How, how did I end up with a demon like you? How? Stop. Get this for her. She will be fine. Let her have it. But if she doesn't get better after taking this, please don't hesitate to call me. We may need to take her to the hospital. Thank you very much, Doctor, for arriving promptly. And thank you for covering this within the family. The pleasure is mine. But don't let this happen again. Because you know that if anything goes wrong, I will not be able to cover up for this. Um, Doctor, nothing will go wrong. But if anything goes wrong, we will stand by the truth. Thank All you, right. Doctor. I'll take my leave now. All right. Thank you. Okay. Have a good day. You too. for his money. I will drag him to the end of the earth. I will drag him like never before. I will make sure I frustrate him. I will make sure I cannot sit down and be comfortable on that chair. I will drag him until he forgets his name. fight and what is this that i'm hearing that she has moved the family money if in 24 hours you do not bring back that money i will be the one to call the police on you and after you're done with the police then you will be moved from there to wherever it is you want to go to you see this madness that both of you are bringing into this house i will have to cure it once and for all What were you telling me over the phone? I don't understand. Bro, everything is gone. Everything is gone. Like, they're still investigating it, but there's no dime left in the company's account again. And you think Vivian did this? 
I know she did it. She's the only one that has the pain now. What? Wait, you, you mean you gave Vivian the company pain? Are you stupid? I was I was just trusting my wife. <laughs> You're a very stupid woman, I'm telling you. There is no limit to your stupidity. I mean, I, I warned you against this. So why would you? Why would you give her your pain? Your company pain for that matter. Look, and how is it that you can't find the money? That's what I'm saying. I, like, I, I'm confused. The, the money cannot be traced to any account. The money was wired online, outside of this country. That money is abroad. We're still trying to trace it. I'm, I'm confused. I don't even know what is happening. I don't know what is happening. Look, Mark, you don't need to be confused. If you know Vivian is responsible for this, put a call across to her and make sure you find that money. Else, it is better for you to report this into the police so that she can be behind bars and begin to talk. If you're the ones behind bars, nobody will support you. Not even Mama. And don't call me. Chris, that's why I'm going crazy. Chris, that's why I'm going crazy. That's why I'm going gaga. You have not seen crazy. You will see crazy when they search for that money and they don't see it. And don't forget, nobody is going to talk about Vivian when it comes to this money. All fingers will be pointing at you. Because, I mean, you were the CEO at that time now. Wait, are you... Are you here to help me solve my problem or you're here to judge me and add and, and add salt upon my injury? I am not here to solve anything. I am just telling you to call Vivian and look for that money. If you don't find that money, there will be more trouble for you and you will see crazy because this family has labored for this money. I just want that money to vanish into thick air, thin air. And when you started this rubbish, I warned you. I told you never to give your pain to your wife. But you told me you were trusting Vivian. You know her very well. But look at it now. A family that labored for their money and you wanted to just vanish like that into thin air and you think they're going to be calm with you no now this has gone beyond family matter it will end up in the police Chris, what, what do i do i'm confused i'm confused mark you don't need to be confused you better by putting a call across to vivian if you know she's the one responsible yes and put her behind bars and make her talk because if you don't do this, my brother, you'll be the one behind bars. And nobody, I mean nobody, not even me, will come to your rescue. Chris, my house is on fire right now. My house is on fire. I'm confused. I don't know what to do. What will I do? What to do? I don't know what to do. I'm losing my mind, Chris. Chris, I'm losing my no! mind. Get a grip of yourself. Look, don't lose your mind. Look for that money. Because your family have labored for that money. And look for it quick. Very fast! Chris, what if, it, what if I can't find that money? Oh. <laughs> if you can't find it, it's very simple. Take a stroll. Look for somewhere very comfortable, right? End this series. End it all. That is if you understand what I mean. Because at this point, I can't help you. I have a very peaceful family meeting I need to attend to, huh? Please, are you... Please, I think I should end it all. Is there anything left for you? My friend? No matter what you say, you do not have any proof that I stole money from you or from anybody. In fact, I didn't steal any money from you or, or anyone as a matter of fact. You think I'm stupid? I'm not stupid! I know you took that money. I know you did it. I know that you took that money. And I swear to God, if you don't bring out that money, eh? Anything that happens to you tomorrow, just take it like that. Because henceforth, I am never going to fold my hands and, and support you. I will never support you. Henceforth, I am against you. I swear to you. Go ahead. You, you have spoken as narrow-minded as you are. That's what you just vomited. All your senses is what you just vomited here. You will not defend me. You won't... Mm, you want to use me as a scapegoat, right? <laughs> no problem! Go ahead, whatever you want to do. Do it! Then you have to explain to everybody how your pin got in my hands in the first place. Yes! You explain where that money went to. You will have to explain. So if you don't have proof, tell me. On what ground do you want to arrest me? Tell me! Wait, wait. You, you, I, you mean I don't have proof of how my pin got? So how did it get to your hand? If I don't know, tell me. How did it get to your hand if I don't have proof? Vivian, you! I swear to God, tomorrow eh, you will know on the ground on why I'm arresting you. You will know. I don't have proof. 
I don't have proof of, of, how, of, of, of how you got my pin. Don't worry, when the time comes, you will know on what ground I am, I, am, I am arresting you for. Vivian, you, if you don't return that money, we are all ruined. And I swear I'm not going down with you. I am not going down with you. You are a Jezebel, you are wicked, you are ugly, you are a witch, you are a murderer, you are a killer. You are... Do whatever you want to do. I dare you. Do anything that you want to do. But you see this time, I, Vivian, I'm standing tall. Taller than all of you. And you see this beating that you have given me today. This beating that is making all my body to hurt like this. You see this beating? I promise you, your blood will spill for this. What did you say? You heard me. What? What did you say, Vivian? You want to hit me? No, what did you say? No! Come and hit me. Hit me again! Do it one more time! You, you take this dog you did out there! Try it! Do it one more time! Then, if you won't spend your years in police custody fighting for your freedom from domestic violence, then you will know that my name is not Vivian! I will make sure! I will make sure! Try it! Try it one more time and you, you will be so shocked at what will happen to you! How, how did I end up with a demon like you? How? Oh. How did I ever end up with a weakling, a fool, like you for a husband? I don't care. I don't care anymore. I am calling the police. My daughter. Not today. Not today. Allow things to happen. Allow the police to come in first thing tomorrow morning and arrest Vivian. We have had enough of her. 